Hello, everyone. Thanks for joining us tonight. A new Iberia woman was scammed out of $8,000 after responding to an online ad. News 10's Jasmine Dean joins us now with just how this scam works. Candy Oob is warning people that a scam is going around Acadiana, taking advantage of people like her. And it said that I had a Trojan spyware virus or something to call the number immediately. I was going to lose everything on my computer. Candy Oob says she was scammed out of $8,000 when she called a number on a pop up ad from Microsoft saying her computer had viruses and she needed to call the provided number. She said she was with Microsoft. She talked to me for a while and she downloaded a program on my computer and showed me that. There had been an $8,000 charge for child trafficking, and it came out of my account. Oob says she was transferred to the fraud department, where she was then instructed to take the cash out of her account so the charge wouldn't go through and place it into a Bitcoin account. It's always very difficult, if not impossible, to get that money back. Oob says she went to authorities who informed her she most likely will not be able to get her money back. Emily Fontenot with the Better Business Bureau says scams like these are very common and scammers target people like Candy because it tends to be easier. A lot of times they can get money faster or they use the scare tactics in order for them to believe them. The Better Business Bureau says people should watch out for elderly scams. At least 5% of all elderly people experience some sort of financial fraud and exploitation. Those are the ones who report it, as it's believed many go unreported. Jasmine Dean, KLFY News 10. Thank you, Jasmine. The BBB says people can be aware of scams like this if they are ever asked to pay for something or send money in non-traceable ways, such as gift cards, money orders, and sometimes Bitcoin.